Greetings! Today we'll be viewing a 1 vs 1 between Lethal Injection and myself on the map of Bison Yard. I like this map because it's... You know, you start with a bit of metal. Um, if you do like teams, everybody starts around the same. But then you have the metal plates in the center, which are really worth grabbing. They're like 2.3 metal per extractor, and some of them hold like 9 extractors, so it can be huge. And you get a deep core up on those. I, God, it's so much metal. It's, it's, it's It gives you a ridiculous amount of metal, honestly. But let's do this. Let's speed this up. All right, we have myself in the top right and lethal in the bottom left. Looks like I'm starting K bots. So you have like some good amounts of metal on these. Most of the metal is in the center. There's little bits of patches elsewhere. And then you have, I mean, in a one versus one, you have tons of metal to start with, right? Lethal grabbing his resources. I am stalling on metal. Not, you know, not the best right now. I feel like he's in a better position than me, definitely. I tried to get an early lab up so I can grab metal quicker, but here I am. We'll see how it goes. It's been a while since I've... Uh, this game, this match was played, so I don't remember the ins and outs. He is getting some defense up in the back. That's pretty smart. Um, I mean, the best, the best way to really come in is to go around the doors and just shoot in here. So that's that's good. And we're pumping out, pumping out those fleas. Looks like, you know, what I was doing maybe paid off. I have about the same. We're making about the same metal. He has much more than me though as he's been making that metal for longer and we're both kind of struggling on energy he is getting some advanced solars up here and back that'll help out a bunch my fleas are just gonna fall to his commander I'm sure didn't take out a thing wasn't worth it I could have I could have accomplished the same thing with one flea I'm trying to get a few things up in the center here. Start getting some peewees out. And both of us are still struggling on energy. I'm doing really bad. Uh, too many, too many metal extractors on. I should have just turned these outside ones off, honestly, until I got a little bit better. That would have been a better play. Because it took me a long time. This is like 300% speed. <laughs> it took me quite a while to get my energy under control, it felt like. I mean, honestly, we're not too different. In fact, I'm actually bringing in a little more metal than I'm at this point. He's bringing his commander to the center here. I don't have much. I'm getting I'm trying to get an HLT up to prevent him from doing much, but I don't know how well that's going to go. I do have lots of peewees just flooding in. I don't think I've really damaged him at all. No, he's barely missing anything. <laughs> he's got the one shell shocker that's just kind of shelling me out. And he's only got one kill. Looks like he's just doing all the damage to me. So I've almost got that up. Alright. So I should be pretty decently protected against the commander if he tries to move forward. Flashes might be an, another thing. With the help of the peewees though, it, it worked out. Unfortunately, I don't have enough energy to keep it firing. I've really fallen behind on that. He's, he's still building some. I'm I'm 
stopped. I'm getting a Geo up. I lied. But this... This little bit without any metal is kind of killing me. That that was real lucky on my part. <laughs> if he had moved those flashes forward, I did not have the energy to stop that. But um, luckily, they just parked right in front of me. So Almost got that Geo up. I did get that Geo up, so my HLT should be running at 100% now. I'm not building anything, though. I'm wasting metal right now. I was working on getting energy under control. But now I need, you know, I started to grab all this. That's where a lot of my energy was going to. Jesus. And now I'm not building, so I really need to take care of that. Should have maybe built more um, defenses. But I didn't. I decided to build metal storage instead, which was a waste because now it's dead. <laughs> I am attacking him back here, but he does have enough enough LLTs up that I didn't get anything done. I destroyed some LLTs and like a wind generator. He is grabbing all this. That's good on him. Tides? I don't remember what tides were. They must be good though, right? must be good yeah they're like 25 that's pretty pretty nice so he comes up here luckily I have twilight so they don't all get taken out but he does manage to get my cons and I yeah, figured out there were twilights so that is gonna hurt me on metal a lot I'm trying to set up some defenses because that's a lot of freaking tanks right there I am just wasting metal this game. I'm not sure what I was doing here. Alright, managed to solve that little flash problem. There's still a couple hanging out with my twilights. And he's moving to set up a defensive in the center here. I gotta sneeze. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm trying to take out the Geo. Luckily I had claws, but they didn't make it. They weren't enough. He's managing to get some shots over the uh, dragon's teeth, it's looking like. And right now, I mean, had some peewees that I could send down there, but wasn't worth it. He's just trying to shoot through the uh, teeth there. Getting, starting a bunch of K-Bot labs here. I'm doing the same. Great minds think alike, right? At this point, I really should have gone advanced. I'm not sure what I was doing. We both could have gone advanced real easy. A level 1 fight would have just been more fun, though. But he's still working on this. Uh, the numbers are increasing. He's very slowly doing <laughs> that down. But I said, you know, I probably don't need that. We'll just leave it for now. I'm trying to get some metal storage up so I stop wasting it. Then this just turned into like an all-out brawl, really. Like he got 4K bot labs up, plus a vehicle plant. I've got 4K bot labs up. I'm missing that vehicle plant. I am starting advanced though. Got an advanced fort back here, putting up um, some pit bulls and, and the like. Nobody's gone there yet. You know, sometimes I just 
highly enjoy huge K-pop battles. <laughs> I didn't want to ruin it with hair. Also, I wasn't, I wasn't thinking about air very much. I was, you know, I would have been great. He does have flackers up. But I probably could have accomplished quite a bit with air. Did manage to clear out the uh, solars and pulverizers there. This, I really needed to hit this stuff. That probably would have hit him really hard. That's where air would have come in. He's got five guardians back here. That's kind of rough. I think I've just got fleas piling up back here. We need to get an advanced fort back here. Working on the nano. And it's pretty much just non-stop K-Bot clashing, which I was, on, I was really enjoying. <laughs> it's not every day you get to just run K-Bots into each other. I'm trying to get rid of some of these labs. This is where air would have come in. If I had made air, I could have just made some bombers come right down and just pop. <laughs> it would have been glorious. Too many pit bulls. I just can't get close enough with K-Box, but I'm stubborn and I just keep trying. I mean, at this point, I needed all these K-Bots to, to counter the ones coming in. I could have put up some Guardians. That probably would have been a really good idea. If I put a Guardian, like, right here, right here, with a blocker right here, and, like, maybe a couple beamers like this, I think that would have done a really good job at holding them off. Honestly, that would have been great. Just curious what it looks like on the radar. I'm out of energy, as per usual. I don't know what I'm doing with it all. Maybe the advanced finished. The advanced did finish. I'm, I went straight for a m deep core. <laughs> Some micro fusions. I was going all in. Figured this is probably the the best place to hold up because I had an advanced fort. I could set up some decent defenses. This would not have been a good place. I didn't feel like I'm just getting really close to my main box there. Trying to protect my Geo. Stacking those uh, construction vehicles down there. Luckily for me, because if he had added vehicles to this, that might have been might have been tr pretty troubling. <laughs> he had made all these, uh, what are they, Junos? Not Junos, Janus. The arm rocket vehicle. I might have been in trouble. Anything, Stumpies would have, Stumpies would have hurt. There were a lot of things he could have done. He does have advanced stuff as well. Because, I mean, for the... Like, it takes about 10 minutes to get metal from a construction unit for it to, like, pay off. And they make, they make half the vehicles do, so. Two, four, six. So, he, I mean, he's maybe got 20 or so metal right there. But they also cost, like, 200 metal, so. 20 times 
to, so he's probably spent like, what, 4,000 metal on that? Had he gotten a deep core up? Let's see. How much a deep core? Um, like a deep core only costs 1,500 metal. It costs a lot of energy, but only 1,500 metal, and it, it's going to net you like 80 on one of those things. You can see, I mean, we're about the same um, resource-wise. He oh, I have a lot more energy now. So I, he has about three more metal than I do. And he's probably invested a ton more into metal than I have. At, at least 4,000, right? I'm really trying to keep this geo alive even though I probably don't even rely on it anymore. He's getting sea plane he's getting sea planes up. Nice. I really should have looked in this lake. <laughs> Had I looked in this lake, I probably could have done a lot. He doesn't have any um Ah, he had it jammed too, that's smart. That's smart. He doesn't have any torpedo launchers or anything like that, though. So what am I doing with my advanced? Right now, I'm sending out spiders. I'm I'm being cheap for no reason, really. Because I am wasting metal right now. I've got 11,000 in all. I could have made a gantry. Oh, I played so badly this game. Looking at it. I <laughs> just got ticks running through paralyzed and stuff. <laughs> I did manage to capture his uh, stuff down, <laughs> down there. He's got his commander down there, so I could do anything about that. I wonder, can you reclaim a commander? I don't think you can, but... That you know, okay. <laughs> it's like I wonder. I've never, I've never actually tried to reclaim the commander because it's suicide. <laughs> really trying to come in. Uh, these guardians are doing a pretty good job at keeping me back. I almost got that advanced K-bot lag. Got spiders coming out the woodworks to try and paralyze stuff. I was having a lot of fun playing with different units that I don't normally use here. But, oh, he stopped the seaplanes. Got an amphib complex. Getting some cloaked fusions up down there. And the Zeus are just tearing me up. Zeus are a really nice unit. He's got like five Zeus just walking into the cloud of purple I've gotten. And they're just doing work. <laughs> now that's an unfortunate um, group of units to run into. But He did manage to get a harpoon up. I'm trying to get invaders over to to kill it. I really I should have gone here. I don't know what's wrong with me. I did the smarter thing and sent some pelicans over. At this point, where are we at resource-wise? So I, I'm getting 284, he's getting 200. Honestly, once you pass a certain point, it doesn't matter, we're both wasting metal, so I'm just overbuilding my economy at this point. I'm not even using it all. 
I should have built more advanced. I should have built a gantry. I really should have built a gantry. Like, once you get 280 metal, what are you doing with your life if you don't have a gantry? Come on. <laughs> no gantry. No nukes. No Berthas. What are, what are you doing with your life? I bet I could have nuked them, too. <laughs> I bet he didn't have anti-nukes. That would have been a great great thing to do. I was really stubborn this game though and I was trying to make it through with K-Box. Just trying out some Marauders. They they ran into some unfortunate stuff there. They're just too slow. You can't get close enough to the pit bull to shoot at it. He is going advanced there. Honestly, if he had finished that seaplane platform, it probably would have been open for me. I have no, I have no AA. I wasn't thinking about. There was so much ground stuff. I AA wasn't wasn't even on my mind. It should have been because there's so much ground stuff. Trying to go around. It's just, you just hear the sound of the Zeus is killing everything. <laughs> Trying amphibs to like get the jump on these things, but. Should have oh I can't come over here anymore because of those. I should have sent more pelicans, honestly. I should have made a lot of pelicans and just sent them through. That would have absolutely worked. Would have absolutely worked. He do does have advanced vehicles. I think that's from the amphib complex. Yeah. Okay. So just carnage in the center here. Meanwhile, I don't know what I'm doing over here. Just building up defenses with a, uh, a spy bot, it looks like. I'm trying to do some sniper stuff here. I don't actually know what had happened to my sniper. It just died. Yep. Did he live? I feel like he died right there. I don't know why he got so close. It was probably something I did. It's a nice group of Rockos and Warriors here. Dead to Zeus's. <laughs> He's just got so much stuff. He's got a lab building fleas, a lab building hammers, one building Rockos, one building Jethro's, and then he's got Zeus's coming out. And now he's got air. couple blades so now I'm I can say I can't say that hurt my resources but <laughs> I definitely oh he's got a spirit too and that's that's pretty much it like I have nothing to defend against all that I sent all my stuff over there so now he's gonna come through here I don't know what I was thinking I got my butt kicked. <laughs> Beamers going crazy over here. Oh, I was trying to see how many kills I had, but here we are. I bet this has some kills, eh? 32? Nah, no, not really. Not for the amount of stuff being sent out there. This uh, uh, moving that over a little bit. So he's got 4,500 kills. I've got 2,500. Holy smokes! But this is uh, he's got like 10 spirits coming in. This, <laughs> there's no way I can stop all this. Oh my gosh! Not my best performance, but I will say. I had a pretty good time in this game. 
I got my butt kicked. But it's not every day you get to just throw K-Bots at K-Bots. And then get creamed by like 20 spirits and 15 blades. But overall, it was a pretty good game. Um, a lot of things I could have done better. I don't... I don't know about these, but because those are expensive, that's like 200 metal, and in 10 minutes you'll get a half a metal. That's, it's a half metal a second, but like, you know, especially on a map like this, if he just built a deep core, that would have it would have done what he was trying to achieve with all these, right? Now it doesn't give you any energy, but still, even a deep core on like a 2.0 patch, you still get a, I think it's about 21 metal for 1500, so way more effective. I mean, if you have the excess metal, then I guess you might as well, but I wouldn't focus on making construction units as a primary source of metal. I've wasted so much metal, oh my god. I wasted more metal than I make sometimes here in some some games. Cause see, even after all those construction vehicles, he was still behind over a hundred thousand metal. So I can't say I'd recommend doing that. I can't say it's worth it. If you have extra metal, then you might as well, or if you're in a really tough spot, maybe. But it's just it's just rough. All in all, though, this was, this, was, this was a really fun game. A really good game. He really whooped my butt. Uh, the air, I should have been expecting it, but I wasn't. I was just focusing on K-Bots trying to get through, and I got caught with my pants down. <laughs> I'm surprised neither one of us made any nukes or gantries or anything like that. <laughs> but thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.